Hello friend. My name is Chisum Udochupu. I am a great great sex and relationship coach. And this you are welcome to my YouTube channel. In this particular video, I want to share with you two insights that will help you to drive straight into the emotional feelings of your partner. Sometimes I know you won't enjoy such intimacy with your partner, but along the line, the thing just disappeared all of a sudden, and you don't know how to go about it. So here, that is what I want to share with you in this particular video. How can you drive win the heart of your partner and enjoy the emotional intimacy you once had with her, him or her? It is necessary that the emotional bonding between a couple remains strong. If you marry, if you get married and you are not enjoying such emotional feelings, I want to tell you that something big is missing in your in your marriage life and your life is being threatened whether you like it or not. But once you begin to enjoy that emotional be bonding, emotional being emotionally at peace with your partner, you you it, it's a great thing it's it's one of the surest way of enjoying everlasting peace in your home so in this particular video i'm going to share with us just two tips on how to do go about that it's one is on the side of the men and then the other one is on the side of the women now let's go for the main, one of the shortest way of winning the heart of your wife is to help her out in a domestic chaos. Especially we African men, ma, we we find it difficult to help our wives in domestic in domestic chaos. Homework, we believe that the home duties is for the woman, while the outside duty is for the man, but that is not true. The woman will be grumbling and grudging. This man is there in the sitting room. He doesn't want to help me. Come here. He can't even come here to help me in the kitchen. He can't even come here to talk with me. He just sit, sit, sitting in the sitting room, discussing, watching television or reading the newspaper or browsing with his phone. The woman is there. I want to tell you by that, her heart is being, it's not, it's being pushed away from you. But just try, just try a little bit, go into the kitchen, sit down and discuss with her. You can see the seductive smile in her face. Let alone you come back before her and then go into the kitchen and then prepare the dish for the night. Or you make out time to prepare her best dish for her. My brother, she is going to fall in love with you again and again and again. Another thing, they're not. It's not only that. How many times have you bring, have? How many times do you take your kids to school? It must not be the woman alone. You don't have time, but you make out time out of no time. How many times have you tried to bet your kids in the night? The woman will be in the kitchen. After being after doing the kitchen work, she will also come and bet the children. My brother, this is one of the things that drives her emotions away from you. But you just try to help her once. Or just try to help her in one way or the other. In the homeworks, you will see the seductive smile on her face. Not just for the men. So what I'm trying to encourage our men is the home works is not only for the women if you love your wife cool down and then help her out do those things that you feel come on that is for the women go and cook, uh, cook the food when you come back make sure you prepare the uh, let keep the house in order it must not be the woman alone it is your house so it cannot be her alone so on the other hand, because women, you also have to help your men do some things that you feel come on. This is for the men. It also help, the man. The, the man feels happy. Also, okay, come on, my wife. My, my, my wife feels and she really appreciate what I'm doing. I'm doing. She is really helpful. She's really supportive. 
So being supportive in home, those in homework or the tasks that you feel your command is meant for this particular person is one of the ways of commanding the emotional feelings of your partner. Now, on the side of the women, one of the things, one of the surest way of winning the heart of your man is by being respectful. You can't be rude to your, your to your man and you expect him to to be to to be to be good to you, or you expect him to to behave to be close to you emotionally. When you are rude, you are driving him away from your heart. But if you want to be, if you want to, if you want him to be close to you, close to your heart. If you want him to be the closest person to your heart, come on, sweetheart, be respectful. Respect him. Now, respect means different things to different people. To this man, it means doing this or that. But to the other person, it means doing another thing. Find out what actually respect to respect your man. Respect means to your man, and then respecting, give it to him. Some women find it difficult to answer their husband, my sir. In the Bible, we are told that Hannah answered her husband, my lord. Uh, Sarah answered called her husband, my lord. The, your husband is the head of your home. And I want to tell you that by nature, men enjoy being respected. You will say that, yes, the man has overrode such opportunity, has overrode such opportunity. Yet, if you, want to, if you want to be close to him, if you want to be the closest person to his heart, respect him. Find out what it means, respect means to him, and then respect him in that way. How many times have you tried to wash, wash, wash the pick up his clothes and wash it out for him? You may feel it's a stupid thing that you are not, a, you are not a, his washing machine. He should go and do that. So what I'm trying to say, women, be respectful to your husband. Find out what respect means to him, and then respect him. Respect is all even in, in, a, in, in the Bible. We are told that women respect your husband. He is the head. So he is an authority in the home. I don't know. Forget what the time is telling you. I want to tell you. By nature, men love being respected. Just as you love men helping you in your domestic work. Men also like it when you respect him so in summary you want to go close to the heart of your partner the man please help him out help her out in doing her domestic uh, works now the woman find out time may find out what it means to respect your man these are just the two ways of getting closer and closer and closer to the heart of your woman i remember the time i took the pains to cook a favorite food for my wife and i noticed the different smiles on her face and how she was getting closer closer and closer and closer to me that day we have to override our pride put uh, put your pride aside and make your marriage work that's it for this particular video thank you for watching if you like it just give me a thumb up I also like to read your comments in the comment section. Thank you so much.